Nothing much happens in the small town of Bowling Green, Ohio, but when it does, everyone knows about it. From gossip, fire alarms, and your occasional police riots from time to time. Despite this, Will and Abby have been together for three years, but she still won't give it up. She claims that she's saving herself for him, but that may not be the case. First off, she won't even let me touch her tits, and she's on her fucking period. That sucks. Well, she's been real distant lately, and I've noticed she's been on her phone a lot. Even when we're alone in her room, she's just sits there texting someone. Well, do you think she's been texting Heather or Lauren? Well, I thought that originally too, until Lauren came up to me the other day and asked how Abby was, and basically told me that she hadn't talked to Abby in a couple weeks and said they were busy with volleyball practice. You don't think Abby would talk, be talking to another guy, would you? Whoa, what are you trying to say? Nothing, I'm just... I've heard some rumors. Oh really, like what? Well, I've heard from a friend that your girl gave Mike, the ginger fro kid, um, a blowjob. Well, you literally just told me that my girl gave some ginger fucker a uh, blowjob behind the wolf sitting her dad. I'm just telling you what I heard. Alright, cool man. Alright, well... I better head off to class. I'll see you later. Yeah, same here. Alright, see ya. See ya. Thanks for coming. We need to talk. About what? You've been acting really distant lately. Hello? Are, aren't you going to answer me? You've been acting really distant lately. Like for now. Like you're even on your phone. <coughs> Speaking of which, who are you texting on your phone anyway? Chris? My best friend? Really? What the hell? YOLO. Pickle, pickle, pickle. Damn it! What the fuck, Chris? What the fuck is this? I was gonna tell you. What the fuck is this? I was gonna tell you. What is this? What the fuck is this? What do you mean you're gonna tell me? What are you gonna fucking tell me? To love is to suffer. To avoid suffering, one must not love. But then, one suffers from not loving. Therefore, to love is to suffer. Not to love is to suffer. To suffer is to suffer. To be happy is to love. To be happy, then, is to suffer. But suffering makes one unhappy. Therefore, to be unhappy, one must love, or love to suffer, or suffer from too much happiness. I hope you're getting into that. Bubble. That's what you get for all your 